Now at 5.30, should a motel turned into a college dorm? Well, that's a big topic of concern in the city of Williamsburg. William & Mary has plans to close an on-campus dorm for renovations, so they want to turn a days in into a place for upperclassmen to live. But that plan is not sitting well with people who live near the hotel. Ten on your side's Brandy Cummings is live in Williamsburg with both sides of this issue. Brandy? Yeah, guys, you know, this isn't a new issue, though. This actually came up last year when the William & Mary Real Estate Foundation agreed to purchase the land for that hotel. But just as things seem to be moving forward, many people who live in that area have stepped up to say they don't support it. This is the motel at the center of debate. It's currently open for business and sits down the street from the William & Mary campus. The school wants it to be a dorm. This is an important project for the university and good for the city because it allows us to keep more of our students in university-operated housing. People living nearby aren't sold on the plan. Dozens packed the planning commission meeting this afternoon to voice concerns about the proposal. Uh, there's a lot of things that worry me about the proposal. Uh, a lot of things that worry me from the standpoint of, of impact on the communities. Um, noise, traffic, late night activities of the students, um, you know, foot traffic through the neighborhoods. The William & Mary spokesperson says the school needs this space because of plans to close Landrum Hall for renovations, adding the days in property keeps students from having to go outside of their housing system. I know that some neighbors have expressed concerns, but I think all in all, we have really good students. Um, anybody that, uh, any student that is in university housing is under our student code of conduct. And if there are any issues, we are prepared to respond. There's a lot of people that are very committed to, to seeing those neighborhoods stay strong and thrive. And they are committed to seeing the college stay strong and thrive. I, I, I want to see us find a win-win. Now, the uh, public hearing just ended a moment ago. The Planning Commission is still currently discussing uh, whether or not they will approve this plan. Some of the concerns they mentioned were uh, the fact that there is a higher number of students for the space than the city allows. Also, there are concerns about uh, whether taxes will continue to go to the city if this is, in essence, turned over uh, to a dormitory, and uh, also where the students will go. So again, all of those things still being discussed right now. We do expect for the Planning Commission to make a vote. I'm going to head back in the meeting. We'll have another update for you on Wavy News 10 at 6. We're now live in Williamsburg. I'm Brandy Cummings, 10 on your side.